Hi, it's Charlie Seymour Jr. And this is Dr. Mark Costner. And we just had a terrific interview with Ken Betterton. This guy's a former Marine. He's a Utah State trooper. He was. He was a commander there. That's right. And he takes all that great experience and brings it into his internationally recognized motivational speaking career, leadership training career, executive coach, all of these things. He's just a terrific guy. So listen to this short question and answer. We've got some more information for you at Join the end. Join us at the end. Yeah, we'll be right back. Wow, here's a big one for a lot of people. And in your power principles, I know how important this one is to you because there are three different areas you talk about, and this is one of those. Let go of the past. Yeah, personally and, and professionally, the people that I have the opportunity to executive coach with, and myself, you know, the, the, there are all kinds of factors from our past. There's the, the great Christmases and the good events and the socialization, those things that went well. But the thing that derails us from inner peace and from happiness and from success is dwelling on those past mistakes. Mm -hmm. it, we, there is, you can't move forward if your eyes are fixated on, on the, back, uh, the back of life. And we all have made mistakes. We have to let those go. It's, I, I equate it to... Uh, a newspaper. Yes. Yesterday's newspaper. It's been written. It's been printed. It has been read. Everybody has read it. But guess what? Tomorrow morning when you roll out of bed, there's going to be a new newspaper. And that old one's on a scrap pile it's, or it's being that, recycled. It's gone. Yeah. All the fear and the anxiety and shame and guilt that you can muster is not going to change one word of that past. Uh, that's a good the point. key is to move forward and live today. Yeah. Live present. Live with quality today. Um, that newspaper is a great analogy. I love how you bring that up. <laughs> I've heard you say that on your talk. Everybody's sitting there and they're going like this. They understand it at that point. And you're not saying don't cherish those wonderful moments. It's those things that you're dwelling on, the, which we dwell on those negative things. You've got to let go of that. Get rid of it. Let it yeah, go. The, the easiest way for me to equate it is what is the stuff that's keeping you awake at night? That's the stuff you've got to sewer and get out of your life because yeah. it is of no value other than destruction and shame and guilt. So, yeah. How do we do that? Easier said than done, but it can be done. Yeah. So, I can't believe that there are 29 questions and answers we have from Ken Betterton. We spent a ton of time with Kenny after an event that he did. It was terrific. We cover so many different topics. 29 questions and answers. You can have them all. We're going to give all of those to you. All you need to do is click that link below. That's right. KenBettertonSpeaker.com. KenBettertonSpeaker.com. Come on over right now. They're free. They're just all available. You're going to find a ton of great stuff. You're going to learn a lot about Ken. You're going to learn a lot about those motivational things that are needed by all these different organizations. Right. So click that link. Come on over. You're going to get all 29 when you do. KenBettertonSpeaker.com. Get all this good information.